Hello and welcome to another session of our webinar series, Study at Technico. Thank you for joining us today. My name is Agatha and I'm the, uh, in the editions office team of Technico Lisboa. Today I'd like to introduce you uh, to our beautiful city and of course the best engineering, science, technology and architecture school in Portugal, Technico Lisboa. Our school is located in Lisbon, the capital city of Portugal, a southwestern European with the same time zone as the UK. We are very well situated in the world, a short distance from many other European capitals. Now, let's get to know a little bit more about our wonderful city. Lisbon was elected among more than 150 cities worldwide as one of the 21 places of the future, standing out now for the quality of its universities, infrastructures and safety. And so you may city. ask, why Lisbon? Lisbon is the capital city of Portugal, one of the most charismatic and vibrant cities of Europe. Portugal is also the third safest country in the world. We have an amazing weather. With over 2,000 hours of sunshine, we are considered one of the sunniest countries in the world. Don't speak Portuguese? Don't worry. We don't have that kind of problems here. The Portuguese are good at learning foreign languages, especially English. Enjoy the experience of living in Lisbon, starting every day with a bica and a pastel de nata. Well, Lisbon is a lot more than just a fantastic tourist destination with important monuments. Great weather and our food is delicious. Uh, so we also have a very high quality education system with remarkable universities. The best example of that is Universidade de Lisboa. Take a look. Bem-vindo. Esta é a tua nova casa. Aqui vais viver os melhores anos da tua vida. Nem sempre vai ser fácil. Nem tudo irá ao encontro das tuas expectativas. Mas garantimos que vai ser incrível. Disse, temos a certeza. Começa aqui. Agora. As horas na biblioteca. Os novos amigos. Os exames. Os cadeirões. As festas académicas. As novas experiências. E tudo aquilo que tu quiseres. Porque chegaste aqui. E a partir deste momento. Pode ser tudo aquilo que ambicionares. Vai, vive tudo ao máximo, viveremos tudo contigo, lado a lado. Porque nós somos a tua casa. A casa que te viu chegar e que te vai ver partir com uma bagagem enorme. Serás sempre mais... Boa sorte. Bem-vindo a casa. With 18 schools, 8 campi and more than 400 courses, University of Lisbon, Universidade de Lisboa, is the biggest public university in Portugal. Our international community has over 10,000 students. 
A very, curi a very curious uh, fact is that we have more than 102 nationalities here at the university. As you can see, all areas of knowledge are available for, for you, from engineering to law, sports, pharmacy, literature, and many others. However, uh, Universidade de Lisboa is not only about studying. We have great uh, sport facilities, canteens, and student accommodations, which are available to all students. Anyway, if you wish to pursue a degree in engineering, science, technology, and architecture, you can find the perfect offer here in engineering from Universidade de Lisboa. We are the biggest school of the university, representing over 25% of its total. So if you love engineering, science, technology, and architecture, get ready and come make the discovery of your life. Now, let me show you a little bit more about our school. Well, this amazing centenary institution, Technic Lisboa, not only stands out for its programs, but also for its excellent position in world rankings. And rankings are rankings, but we are the best school of engineering in Portugal and one of the best in Europe and in the world. For a lower price, but the highest quality of an academic experience, you will become the top notch of the world. In what concerns our academic offer? Technic Lisboa offers bachelor, master, uh, PhD, postdoc degrees, as well as the online courses, the so-called MOOC. Technic Lisboa has 19 different bachelor programs for now that for now are uh, fully taught in Portuguese. Uh, we also offer a wide range of degree from the most innovative ones such as aerospace or biomedical or even physics engineering to the more classical ones but equally important such as civil and mechanical engineering. If you pursue your investment in education, you have available 33 master programs fully taught in English. This will allow you to deepen your knowledge and to become one of the top notch on your field of expertise. Very important to mention is that during your degree, Technical Lisboa offers you the chance not only to have an international experience, but also to undertake a double degree, having a final degree certificate from Universidade de Lisboa and another university very well ranked worldwide. The opportunity to become an international expert on your field of uh, studies is here at your hands at Technic Lisboa. Technico uh, has a teaching model uh, in line and updated to meet the demanding challenges of today's world. Uh, new curricular components are often introduced and the teaching methodologies are top of the game valuing the academic life and extracurricular uh, experience of the students. Technic Lisboa bonds its academic strategies with the best schools of science and engineering in Europe. In need of a break from all this study, enjoy as well the lifestyle that Technico has to offer. Check this out. If you're looking to have fun with good music and entertainment, you can always count on the parties and tunas of technical students, a group of students who play traditional instruments and sing serenades. 
Want to take your curriculum a step further? Join our student groups. We have more than 40 in all areas, from building a Formula One racing car to a solar boat. We can guarantee you won't have a dull moment at Technical Lisboa. From fun to innovation, Technical Lisboa has been developing pioneer research projects, contributing in a decisive way to the economic and social development of the country. Research in Technical Lisboa is organized in centers and institutes that carry out challenging research programs with strong social impact in the fields of architecture, engineering, science and technology. We present you one of the most remarkable projects, our Gasparzin is part of the Monarch project, which focuses on robots that interact with children, developing interactive activities in the pediatrics ward of the Portuguese Institute of Oncology in Lisbon. Well, we can clearly say that Technic Lisboa is a forefront school focused on innovation and you can still have fun while doing it. How can you not get excited about this? Anyway, I think we should get to business now. Uh, did you know that if you study at Technic Lisboa, you can get a job and be employed even before you finish your degree? Many employers come to Technico to recruit students. How do you feel about having the chance to find a job abroad? Our statistics don't lie. We always encourage our students to be the best so that they can target companies they wish to work for and have a bright career in the future. The best example of that uh, is what our what our alumni have accomplished so far. The first uh, woman prime minister in Portugal was a former student of Technic Lisboa. Her name was Maria de Lourdes Pintasilgo and she graduated in chemical and industrial engineering in 1953 at a time when few women went to into the field of engineering. As well, are you familiar with the United Nations? I bet you are. So here we have Antonio Guterres, Secretary General, which, and he is as well an, an alumni from Technic Lisboa and a former lecturer. Uh, just out of curiosity, he studied electrical engineering and graduation, graduated in 1971. In the middle, we can find Carlos Moedas, the current mayor of the Lisbon city. Uh, but better than all of this is to listen to them explaining their experience here at Technico. When I started looking for a university abroad, I want to make sure that I would find a degree that would make it easier for me to get a great job later on. And at the same time, I want to be sure that I would be able to experience the life in the city I was studying in. And IST did not disappoint. It gave me the knowledge that the employers need, while at the same time it allowed me to study 10 minutes from the city center. And Lisbon is a vibrating city with a lot of affordable activities for students. In fact, I loved it so much, seven years later, I'm still here. And if I was able to do it all over again, that's what I would do. Seriously, consider it. Hi, my name is Rani Putri and I am from Indonesia. I am an alumni of IST Lisbon. I graduated in 2014 and I received my master's there. I had absolutely the best time of my life going to school in IST Lisbon. It is one of the top ranked schools in Portugal. It offers many international opportunities because of their innovative programs. And I cannot stress this enough, but the professors there are super, super helpful and so friendly. Um, they will help you in any way they can. Um, they really want you to be successful and you have no idea how many times I bother all the professors and they're just really helpful and I'm so thankful for them. Um, also, the school itself has a lot of research facilities and research departments and IST Lisbon is a very diverse as well. Um, I had a lot of friends from all over the world. I have friends from Brazil, Colombia, Russia, China, India. Um, everywhere around the world. Um, also, the city itself is breathtaking. Um, it's so pretty and the city is full of history and it's so rich in culture and traditions. Um, and the beach is only 20 minutes away from the school, so it's a bonus. And the Portuguese people, they are 
they are the best. They are very friendly. Even if they can't speak English, they will help you in any way they can. Um, so that's why I had the best time going to school and I see Lisbon. Quite impressive, don't you agree? Well, another demonstration of what uh, all that you can achieve here with an education uh, are, are our unicorns. Let me show you. In finance, a unicorn is a privately held startup company with a current valuation of $1 billion or more. Did you know that Portugal has as many unicorns as Spain, Greece and Italy combined? There are currently five Portuguese unicorns. Talkdesk is a company created by two former technical students, Cristina Fonseca and Tiago Paiva. It is among the 100 best private companies operating in the cloud area worldwide, according to the Forbes magazine list. Unbabel, founded by technical alumni João Graça and Vasco Pedro, it combines machine translation with human translation, bringing together on a platform a community of bilingual translators that improve the quality of work. Well, now that we have shown you so much of what uh, Technic Lisboa has to offer, I bet that you are very eager to become one of our students. So you must be asking, how can I apply? How can I be part of this amazing experience? Always remember, very important, the admissions team is here to help you. Our team is here to guide you and will provide you all the necessary information and guidance to make this journey as smooth as possible. Count on us from the application phase to information about your visa issuing until we so proudly welcome you upon your arrival in Lisbon. As you are currently seeing, applications for international students are now open and the admissions office team is ready to help you in at least four different languages. Another question you might have is concerning the documents you will need for the international student applications. Here is how, what you need um, in order to apply. So the documents are very simple and all you need you will have at your hand. Uh, simply uh, your ID, uh, your CV and your academic transcript, either being from your high school or from your bachelor degree in case you are applying for a master's degree. Also, if you are applying for a bachelor degree, don't forget that you will have to prove that you have a sufficient level of Portuguese language and um, all of you will always have to submit as well a statement under oath proving that you are an international student. After this is done, well, we will validate your applications. Anyway, I think that's something that uh, might um, trick you is uh, whether you are considered or not an international student. Don't worry, we are here to help you. So these are some of the specific points to take into consideration when determining whether you qualify as an international student. Be aware that if you live in Portugal for more than two years or if you are a Portuguese or European citizen, you are not considered an international student. If you're still not sure, just drop us an email and we will help you. The application process is very simple and is done entirely on our online platform. To start your application, you should go to our website to the page International Students. You can guide yourself through the screen now. It will always help you on the website. And then just click on Applications as you see there. The direct link is also available in the description box.
it is now my pleasure to introduce to you um, this young but very experienced team that will help you in your admission process. Here you have our admission managers, Diana Freire, Joana Vlesch and Inês Valint. They are always here available for you by email, phone, WhatsApp, Zoom, Skype or any other tools you may need us to use. Well, um, today's webinar includes a special participation of our engineering and management department. I am very pleased to introduce to you Professor Anna Carvalho, who will tell you more about this department and its degrees. Enjoy. Good afternoon to everyone. Thank you very much, Agatha. So welcome to this seminar on the, this webinar in the Department of Engineering and Management. So I'm here as the Vice President of the Department and I'm going to present a bit on what is the offer that we have to, to give you. So who, who are we? What is the Engineering and Management Department? So we have uh, three main streams that we explore, the teaching, the research, and we also provide some services as consulting to companies. And we do this in two main areas, so engineering and management of organizations and engineering management of systems. And uh, what do we offer? So we have many degrees that we can uh, offer in our department. So we start with the Bachelor in Industrial Engineering and Man Management, which is called, we will call now LEGI. Uh, then we have uh, two degrees at the master level, the Master in Industrial Engineering and Management, MEGI, and also the, the Master in Engineering and Management of Innovation and Entrepreneurship, MEGI. Uh, both of them are two years programs. And then if you still want to continue the studies, we also offer PhD programs. Our PhD programs have a duration of three to four years, and we, we offer PhD in Engineering and Management and also in Engineering and Public Policies. So this is our offers, but what specifically are these offers? So about LEGI. So if you are keen to enter in a bachelor degree, uh, LEGI might be your future. LEGI is what we call the best of the two worlds. So LEGI combines the engineering part and also the management side. So you will have all the background of an engineer, but also combine with the business science and uh, you will have the, the way to solve management problems in companies. And this is what companies want. So you will be very, 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 in a very, very good degree. So uh, basically in this degree, you will have the, all the maths and physics and chemistry that all engineers have. And then you will ha have here in yellow some uh, more specific courses that range from uh, accounting, finances, operations, also technical uh, technical uh, courses on mechanical and uh, also electrical engineering and operations management that you will have on this part. Uh, you will also have some uh, courses on uh, humanities, arts and social sciences that they are here to open your mind to other, uh, other uh, institutions in our university and you can enroll the courses in a uh, other institutions in our university and enlarge your mind. And finally, you will finish your bachelor with the integration project where you will apply all the, the, the know-how that you got from the courses in an applied project that can be done with companies or in a research uh, group. And this project is done in a team. So you, you will be working in a team and apply all the knowledge that you acquire. So what is uh, LEGI in uh, numbers? So every year around 90 students enter in LEGI, so you will have a lot, many colleagues that will uh, go with you with, in your journey. And half of them are men and half of them are women, so everyone will be integrated. All the classes are uh, uh, in Portuguese, but if many students are uh, English uh, native, so we can uh, give some uh, guidance in English. And you, you see that in LEGI we have 6% six, six of students that come from outside Portugal. The average final grade of the students that finish Le, uh, LEGI is 14 and 65% of them, they enroll in MEGI, so the master that also our department offers. 
And this might be uh, a journey for you that pa pass from the bachelor's to the master's in a, in a, uh, in a way. So our uh, courses and the LEGI is running at the campus of Tagus Park. And this is a picture where you can see it's a very nice campus where you feel at home because it's very cozy and everyone is very connected. And it's a very, very, very new and nice campus. Okay, so after the bachelor degree, we have two offers at the master level. So the first one is MEGI and the, the master uh, of industrial engineering and management is basically uh, if you want to continue your formation on the uh, industrial engineering side, and if you want to have a solid education in the industrial engineering, this is the, the, the degree for you. So with this degree, you can work in production, distribution, logistics, marketing, finances, strategy, so many areas that you, you, can, you can go for. Uh, in the first year in the master degree, you have some mandatory courses. These mandatory courses, they are mainly from methodologies and methods that you can apply to help companies uh, achieving a better performance. So, Companies really want this, and that's why the majority of our, our students have jobs before they finish uh, uh, the, the degree. Then you also have two profiles. So if you, if you want to be more specific in your, and if you like more the operations and logistics side, you can go for that uh, profile. Or if you prefer more the financial management, you can go more in that direction. So you can choose the, where you want to be more specialized then you have some optional courses that are free that you can all can choose from any area of your uh, taste let's say and finally you will finish your master with a master dissertation this master dissertation is done individually and it can be done with companies also and or with a research uh, group what is magi in numbers so magi you 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 know you will not be alone for sure because around 200 students every year will be with you. Uh, in this case, around 40% of women and the rest uh, are men. And we have 21 courses that are uh, completely teached in English. Uh, the average uh, final grade in this case, it's 16. So it's a bit higher in, at the master level as usual. And you have for sure a job for you so all our alumni are employed and they all have jobs so 100 uh, percent sure that you you are going to get the job and if you come from uh, abroad you will be as technical uh, was saying as agatha was saying with technical so you will be full of people with uh, from different countries 14 countries and always 80 around 80 students are coming to, to our degree and 63 of our students are also leaving. So they are also coming again with the experience from uh, outside. So very international uh, degree. The other option that you have at the second level is MEGIE. So the Master in Engineering and Management of Innovation and Entrepreneurship. So in this case, if you are really keen to know more about uh, and to become a professional uh, on innovation management, design thinking, development of new products and services, and entrepreneurship, this is the master for you. So in this master, you will have also some mandatory courses on these areas of product development, product development, design thinking, innovation, entrepreneurship. And then you have also some optional courses that you can decide. Here, you don't have profiles, but these three options allow you to do a combination of courses that can guide you in certain way of a specific area. So you can combine options more in the environmental side or more in the energy side or more in the informatics side. So it's up to you. So there are uh, options for you to combine and to uh, go in one direction. Then you have also a project where you are going to apply all your knowledge on these uh, topics. And finally, you have the master dissertation at the end. So MEGIA in numbers. MEGIA is very recent, so uh, but already 88 students enrolled in MEGIA since 2019. And 34% of the students are women. Uh, all the, the courses are in English again. and as measured, the final average grade is 16. 
Until now, we only have five students have, that have finished this uh, master, but for sure next year we will have more because this is really recent uh, master. Uh, again, very international, so 13 different countries uh, the students uh, come from, which is uh, very great compared with the numbers with the magic. 28 uh, students incoming and only three outgoing. This is not because you are restricted. If you come to Mejie, you are allowed to go outside. This was really due to the COVID and the pandemic that we, that we are living. Okay, so all these degrees and the, our department offers you a wide range of possibilities for you to go in mobility. So you can see here that we have many, many collaborations with many institutions, the top universities in Europe and also the best universities in the, in the world. Uh, we also, it's also worth to mention that with MEGI, we have two double degrees, one with the Lovine School of Management in Belgium and the other one with the Western Michigan University in the US. So if you join one of these programs, you will spend one year at Technical and another year there, and you will get the degree from both uh, institutions. You can see here that we are really covering almost all the world. So for sure, you, you will not feel alone and you will be integrated when you come here. Also, it's really important to tell you that we are, have a very, very good relations and very, very straight connection with companies. So many companies are uh, part of our consortium. And what we do is we develop projects with the companies in the different courses also, the dissertations, usually they are done together with the, the company's collaboration. And in many events during the semesters, you have the companies there. So you will have very close contact with them. And this is a very good opportunity for you to get the job very quickly. Also, the, during the year, you can find many activities that you can be enrolled. So we have some uh, students association that you can integrate, NEGI, a national one and esteem the European one. So if you like to connect with more people and if you like to uh, spread the, the word of the engineering and management, it's good that you, you get in touch with these associations. Also, they do many events during the semester. So you can uh, enroll in case study competitions. You can go to some fairs with the companies and for technology and many other activities that happen all, the, all over the year. And finally, you ask, so this is great, but what can I do with this? You can do basically whatever you want. And that is true. So basically, you can go from consulting to production, strategy, logistics, marketing, innovation, management, design thinking, distribution, finance, information system. We have alumni working in all these fields and much more. So basically, these degrees are really what, what companies are looking for. So everyone gets a job, everyone can do whatever they want and change how many times they want. So we truly know that these degrees will lead you to a bright future. So we are waiting for you and we hope to see you in a very short time. Thank you very much. I would like to thank our engineering and man management department in the representation of Professor Anne Carvalho for joining us uh, today and for this amazing presentation. Now, we have reserved a few minutes to some answer, questions, comments, anything you would like that uh, came to you during this broadcast, and we will try to answer you as clear as possible. Please uh, feel free to write all the questions you may have. So we have MD Sabir. How many intakes do you have? Well, uh, Sabir, thank you for joining us today. Uh, let me uh, explain to you that Technical Lisboa, as most of uh, universities in Portugal, only have one intake, which is the fall intake in September. All degrees start in September and the academic year goes all the way till uh, July. So it's not possible to enter uh, as a newcomer, and as a new student uh, in the spring semester.
Olivia Charles, thank you for being with us today. Hi, uh, can you please tell me what are the entry requirements to apply to the Master in Entrepreneurship? Well, I will ask Professor Annette Carvalho to help us with this question. Thank you, thank Olivia, you. for your question. Uh, I'm the coordinator of the other master and the other bachelor, but uh, I will try to, my best to give you the answer. But I suggest that you also contact by email the coordinators. That's uh, it's in the presentation. But the, the requirements for you to apply to the master in the entrepreneurship, you need to come with a background of engineering and science. So and then you can apply. And there are some uh, rankings that we do with the, the final marks that you have and then you can enter the program. But basically, you need to be with a background from more the science and technology and engineering. Thank you, Professor Anna. And Olivia is still asking, uh, and mm -hmm. also, is it necessary to have a completed bachelor degree to apply right now? Uh, I can help you with this one, Olivia. Uh, yes, in order to apply to the master degree, you, as, an, as an international student, you will always have to have already finished your bachelor degree. So all the, all the parameters that are decided uh, in our rules uh, to then be able to admit you or not have to be uh, fulfilled and uh, we need all the data in your degree certificate. And Sabir, again, who recruits a management engineer? <laughs> Professor Anne. <laughs> Thank you for your question. Basically, as I said, uh, all the companies. Because uh, in all the companies you have uh, processes and all the companies you have operations that you need to improve. And uh, we, what we teach is how can you improve those operations? How can you improve those processes? So basically any company requires that. So you can uh, range from a consultancy company to an industrial company, manufacturing company. So basically it's uh, any, any sector. Oh, very kind of you, Olivia. Thank you as well for being present here with us uh, today. Um, let me just check if we have any other uh, queries or any comments. Okay, so uh, thank you for participating uh, so much. It's a pleasure to us. And the question is, do I have work after graduation? I don't know if you are talking about uh, bachelor or master, but for sure you will have <laughs> even before <laughs> graduate. So the majority of our students, they get a job even before they graduate. So for sure you will have uh, a job after graduation. Uh, anyone? Uh, Anna Flavia Alves. Hi, Professor and Miss Agatha, could you talk about the available investigation scholarships. Thank you, Anna, for the, for the question. Uh, indeed, sometimes we have uh, scholarships for research, but uh, this really depends on the research project that we have available at the time. So there are not all the time scholarships, but if you are interested in some fields, I suggest that uh, you can contact also with some specific professors from the field and they will let you know if there are any scholarships available at that moment. Thank you, Anna. Uh, thank you, Savir, as well. It's our pleasure. And I think we do not have any more uh, questions today. So I would like to thank you again um, and, that, and I hope we were able to help you. And never forget that if you need any more help, you don't need to be shy and just reach out to us. Um, once again, I would like to thank everyone for being on that side of the screen uh, for the roughly past hour. And I hope to see you soon and here at Technical.